All right, Number look, one. look, we about to we about to screw our brains over. Mm-hmm. We about to argue. We about to do all that. Yeah, Prepare yourselves. We for got Anchor. this chat. chat. We, got, we got, it. got this. We got this. The chat. bucket list. This is a pretty popular term. A bucket list is a number of experiences or right. achievements that a person hopes to have or accomplish oh. during their lifetime. Yeah. Let's say you've always wanted to binge watch Breaking Bad. I think I know but where you're you going with this. You just never got around to it. You put that on your bucket list. But think of the term bucket list. It sounds like an old Which term when did it some start? dude in the 1900s made up for a piece of literature and it catched on or something, right? Mm-hmm. right? Well, not so fast. Apparently, the phrase directly derives from the film with the same name. Simply put, the phrase was recently invented as early as 2007. What? This tends to be yeah. terms of people as they remember using the term before the film was even released. I thought it'd been around. No, I facts. thought bucket list was like 80s, at least 70s or something. Yeah. No, early 2000s with the movie. Okay, I can see that. Even searching it up on Google, you find that the saying traces back to 2007, directly referencing the film. Even the movie writer Justin Zachem credits himself as the originator of the term. That's There's gotta also be pretty cool. no online evidence that the term existed before the film was produced. Nah, that's crazy. One Reddit user stated, heard it in primary school, early 2000s. No idea the exact year, but pretty sure it was around before the movie. I don't know. What do you guys remember about this? Mm. One? Uh, my freshman philosophy professor signed this. I can't. Exercise. I don't know about this one. This one I can. I can give it to the movie. Halo split screen. Halo this split Mandela screen. This runs the popular game franchise Halo, specifically the hit classic Halo 2, okay. and the split screen multiplayer option. Now, many people remember being able to play with a friend on the first two levels, and are surprised when they come back to replay the game with friends that it was never an option to begin Wait, with. What? Yep, you can't play I wasn't the first a Halo two levels player. of Halo 2 with another player. You can only go through it alone. The Heretic Why? and the Armory are solo player levels, Why? though the Heretic is mainly a cutscene. Though this tends to contradict what many people remember. Some recall playing the Armory. Do y'all remember that chat? So look, chat, that's another thing. All right, so I've been a PlayStation boy my entire life, mm-hmm. right? My entire life. Entire life. I can see, see that. Seeing Halo, you know, seeing people play Halo. I've played it at friends' houses. I've never played a full Halo game. I've I've never played a full Halo game. I played one Halo game and I was like 2012, 13 ish, whatever came out around that one. I played multiplayer like maybe two or three sessions. Yeah, I've I played the really I played, played a, a a land multiplayer, but that's it. At one meal we gotta do a haunted video with the boys. If we can make it happen, you feel me? And try whole fast nations at war. Oh. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Play, play Reach. Halo should, Reach. I think is one? that the one I played. Should I should I should I play it for the uh, gaming channel? Because mm. I've I've ne- when I say I've never mm. I've bro I've had a PlayStation in my entire life. Yeah, he got all of them. He still got all of them. I literally one two three four. <laughs> he got all of them. <laughs> like, I have all with like, friends and family. All of if them. you go search this up on YouTube, you'll find videos surrounding the topic and the amount of commenters remembering this option being available is astonishing. One comment with 300 likes reads: When did Halo Reach drop? Armory on co-op and pushing boxes into the elevator. Probably like early 2008 like or some shit. Reply states: Yep. Like 2008, 2009, 2010. We'll wait for it. You can let it play. Me and my friend used to push master guns into the elevator to try and save him from oh, dying. So oh damn! Later. How is that the best one? Damn, bro! How damn. many Halos is it? Four, five. They overdid it. I know that for sure. It's five. I know right? it got. I got, it got to a point where they was like, "Stop! You're ruining it." It's like five. It's got to be at least like five or six. And so, so it's reached like four. It's reached four. <laughs> Jesus. There's seven? seven. I mean, Call of Duty got a million, but and remakes. But so. seven are are the are the Halos linear? Am I following one character? Or is it multiple? Reaches number four in 06. Damn! Jesus Christ. They don't know. Oh. All right. I'm going to give okay. it a try. Okay. Okay. Yes, it's linear. Mission. Okay. I'm having a hard time believing co op was never a thing in that mission. How do you guys remember this level? Was this ever an option, or are people simply misremembering this? See, this, I don't know. Fruit of the Loom trademark evidence. Oh, so we yep. We all know this one. Yep. Right now. Yep. It, it was proven to too. It was proven too. Yeah. Some people remember it, including a cornucopia, though it has never had one in the entire yes, 170 has. year span of the company's yes, existence. Has. 
Well, apparently now there's evidence of yep. this. In 1973, there was a trademark filed for a Fruit of the Loom deodorant. And on that trademark filing, you can see that it lists the logo as having a cornucopia ah, okay, alongside okay. the fruits. For sure, for sure, Though for sure, the art sure. above has for no sure. cornucopia in sight. It Could this it. one be a Mandela effect or simply nah, an no, the lady a pulled shorty? out her shirt. She pulled out her shirt that had the cornucopia on it. There and there and there's a lady who actually did a full like investigation and found it. Mm -hmm. So this old picture of a wall full of newspapers i guess and you can see on the top there's the fruit of the loom logo with the cornucopia as well i don't know guys is this a photoshop or is this evidence that's I mean, definitely real woody's famous line there's a snake in my everyone book. and their moms have watched at least one of the toy story movies there's a right? snake in my boot. remember Tripping. woody's famous catchphrase there's a snake in my boot that's how it goes right yeah nope it's actually there's a snake in my boots boots being no no no, it's, uh -oh. there's no uh -oh. S. Uh -oh. There's no S. There's no S. There's no S. There's no S. And I'm gonna tell you how it's no S. There's there right now. If you go on TikTok and you look up characters in their domains, right? Right. There's a Woody edit, and it's called Snake in My Boot, and it's multiple snakes coming out of individual boots. But how is that proof? Because it's Snake it's the, in My Boot. Because it's the sound. You no, that's. Sound? That's the name of it, Snake in My Boot. Everybody in there was like, oh, there's a snake in my boot, snake in my boot. Everybody was calling snake. There's no S. There's no S. <laughs> there's a snake in your toilet. It's going to be in your ass. Even though it doesn't make any sense. This one has actually got me tripping as it doesn't make sense there being a single snake in both boots. That is true. Take a listen to the original film. There's a snake in my boot. No. That's not Here's how I the remember kicker about this one. That though. can't be. This line only exists in the first movie of the franchise. Can't the rest be. of the films, Toy Story 2, 3, and 4, have the line as it was originally remembered. Somebody get There's the DVD! I boot, mean, the, the VHS! Which may be the main reason why people are remembering this wrong. I don't know, though. How do you guys recall the get line the VHS. Being said in the original movie? Is it boot or boots? It's boot. I remember it boot. It Mona Lisa. It doesn't make nope, sense. This one isn't about her smile. Okay. It's about okay. her black veil. Tons of people are black surprised veil. to find that the Mona Lisa. Black the veil. Wait a minute. You, whoa. 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 Hold Wait up. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Well, a black Wait a minute. Veil. Now, now we doubling it. Now we're adding multiple. Because remember, at one point there was no smile. Then there was a smile. A black veil ain't been there once. Yes. Not once. Not I'm once. Not what? So it's wearing a thin black veil. Over no there. shot. Some believe that it wasn't there before, stating that before a certain year, they vividly remember the Mona Lisa simply having her hair out and about, with no thin black veil on her head to be found, claiming that they would have noticed the great detail that can be now seen within the painting. I mean, just look at how precise the veil is painted, no. looking realistically no. transparent, no. and showing her no. hair. I don't no, know we need a high quality color. shot of the, the thing at the museum. It. As it was a fine detail, you have to pay attention too closely. Object Why can't have on a veil right there in the animation? And that's a animation about it being painted. Why can't have a veil on there? Mm -hmm. The animator would have saw it. Come on now. In the mirror. Objects so you know the objects in the mirror are safety closer than they appear. Engraved on the passenger right? side mirrors of vehicles, right? Mm -hmm. How do you remember the warning? Was it objects in the mirror may be closer than they appear? Well, a lot of people recall it being this way, but it's not correct. Huh? It's actually objects in the mirror are closer than they appear. There is no R. It's maybe. Let's go check your truck. <laughs> hold, on. hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Go take a picture. Go take a picture. <laughs> Go take a picture. Go take a picture. Oh, shoot. Just take your phone. Take your phone. Go take a picture. He going to check right now. Right? Matter of fact, you can call me on Discord. You can call me on Discord, boss. Let me open that up. <laughs> we going to see this. We going to see this. Oh, shit. Oh shit! Wait a minute, my fault, y'all. Do 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 Hello, hello. Hello, can you hear me? Hold on, let me switch the settings. Let me switch this. Huh? I do this for science. 
Hello, 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 hello. Yeah. Okay. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Go, 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 go. Flip it, flip it. Right. Flip that joint. Oh, let's go. Is it even okay, it says, it says R. Hold on. It says R? Oh, check the the yeah. fucking Yeah, check that. We got an old car. Damn, wait, he freezing. Oh shit. Hello? He's he's frozen. He's frozen. Hold on. <laughs> Hel- he- no! No, we lost him. We lost him, boys. He's freezing out there. It says R on both? And that other car was an 05, even though we we couldn't see it because it broke up. Damn. Damn. It says R on both. It's so fucking cold. <laughs> you forgot it was cold. Cold as hell. <laughs> ah, ah. So on the 05 and the 2018, it says it R. It says R. Damn. Damn. Maybe never appears within the sentence. Some strongly argue that maybe was emphasized as determining the distance of something using a mirror could skew your perception as it being farther or closer, though it has never been maybe as it was federally. Maybe we to, maybe we think it's maybe because it just rolls off the tongue better to be written as are closer than the appear, though some swear reading the sign over and over again as a kid during long car rides and remembering it saying maybe Bam. looking like this. Re- Bam. Jurassic Park. Jurassic Park. Jurassic Park. Why are we checking Jurassic Park? Jurassic. I'm gonna look full screen because of the. I remember seeing that on Jurassic Park as well. I mean, that's just a movie, though. <laughs> that's just a movie. They that could be, you know what I'm saying? It wouldn't really matter to the federal mandate. Damn. What is there a mirror scene in Jurassic Park? Yep. Which scene that is? That's what I'm looking for. The mirror scene in Jurassic Park. Jurassic Park mirror scene. Uh, is it this? Yeah, mute. Is it, is it this scene? Yeah, mute. No, look for it. Chasing a car. That's chasing the car. Do you see it? Oh, right there. Right there. R. 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 Oh, wait. Y'all can't see it right there. R. Even in the movie. Damn. R. Damn. Whoa. Damn. Even in the movie. Whoa. <laughs> Damn. Whoa. Got us for sure. Her evidence found here. Maybe closer. Look at that. What car was it? Maybe. Uh, okay. How do you well, at least maybe it was just some the pyramids cars of Giza. had it. The pyramids okay. of Giza are massive tombs, right? Though yeah. many people remember learning this as a verified fact, no mummies were ever found there, beneath what? or inside of the massive pyramids themselves. I thought they were Though there are tunnels and underground passageways underneath the pyramid, no mummies were ever found there. Actually, most of the famous well-known pharaoh sarcophagus, like King Tut and okay. Ramses the Great, are found in the Valley of the Kings. None of them were found near the pyramids. Of so Kings. that was just a damn myth? So that what the pyramids, pyramids were for? tombs? What yeah. they built them for? What they, they, what they what they what I thought that was a whole reasoning. The scream golden what? bracelet. The scream is the popular name given to a composition created by Norwegian artist Edvard Munch in 1893. The agonized face in the painting has become one of the most iconic images mm-hmm. of art, okay. seen as symbolizing the anxiety of the human I condition. Can't tell you, I can't tell Monk you about this Monk recalled one. that he had been out for a walk at sunset when suddenly the setting sun's light turned the clouds a blood red. He sensed okay. an infinite scream passing through nature, which inspired the painting. Now, out of the five revisions created, only the most popular version includes a well-defined golden bracelet that many people do not recall seeing before. Now, this painting is really about this studied one. and so, written about, you know, trying to interpret yeah, its meaning and what it I signifies. I can see how you would miss but it. For some reason, yeah. the bracelet doesn't really get that much attention or notoriety for being prominent in the most famous but version. But that Mona Lisa veil, though, that did, that don't exist. Hell no. We in a different. We're in a different reality. Yeah, no. With some saying that it was never even there to begin with, and that it throws the painting way off. 
Do you guys recall the Scream having a bracelet? This one just gives me the creeps. And it's not even about the Mandela effect aspect alone. Nah, it's just a creepy painting. It's just the painting itself. Yeah, the painting is creepy. It's just very creepy. Isaiah 11.6 this Mandela effect Ooh. is in reference to a Bible passage that some people believe has changed, okay. recalling the passage mm-hmm. as stating, the mm-hmm. lion shall lay with the lamb. I and also couldn't tell you this. Tons of this passage being this way. Not only that, there are tons of imagery from Christian artwork depicting lions laying down with lambs. Mm-hmm. Although the Bible passage has never stated that, it actually says, the wolf will lie with the lamb. To be more specific, it actually states, the wolf will dwell with the lamb, painting a totally different image. This one baffles me. Where the hell come from? It, it was later down. The lion should live with the lamb. Smokey the bear. <laughs> okay. This one's a two for one deal as there's two Uh-oh. fakes going two on for. here. Well, two let's for. start with the first. Okay. We've all heard the saying before, right? Only well, you, you can, can prevent, prevent wildfires. Forward. Said by the well-known educational animal mascots. Wildfires? Wildfires? I mean, I can see it saying wildfire. Only you can prevent forest fires. But I don't remember fires. it saying wildfire. Only you can prevent forest fires. Mm. Okay. Smokey the bear, who teaches people the danger of wildfires and how you can prevent them. Except, turns out, Smokey the bear doesn't exist in this reality, according to some Mandela fic- Hold the fuck up. Hold the fuck up. What are we talking about? Hold the fuck what up. What are we talking about? Hold the fuck up. Hold the fuck up. What are we talking up. about? I, Hold on. Wait, I, I, wait, I saw wait. a commercial last week. I know he's not week. saying what I think he I said. saw a commercial oh, last week. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I think he might be saying something else. I saw a commercial last week. He might be saying week. something else. He might be saying something else. He might but, be saying I, something else. Explain yourself. It's changed. His real name is Smokey Bear with no the in the name. Being stated like this in advertisements for oh, okay. years. Okay. Some okay. people use the 1952 okay. Eddie Arnold song mm. as evidence of residue for his old name. Okay. As seen Jesus. Here. Now the second effect revolves. It was Smokey the Bear. They changed it to Smokey Bear recently. Um, as that being his name. It was Smokey the Bear. And they changed it to Smokey Bear. Mm-hmm. I can see that. Yeah, no, nah, that's that's what as that long is. as he wasn't saying he, he don't, don't exist. Boy, I'm about, boy, I'm about to, I'm boy, about to something, bro. The boy, he's uh, what he's wearing. Many people remember him wearing red suspenders. And yes, and yes. Nipples, though he has simply worn pants without suspenders. Here are some recreations of what people remember. Also known as residue evidence in the Mandela effect community. Wait, wait. Fruit. Is he saying he does not wearing red suspenders? Yes. Ain't no way, because that's a dude with red suspenders. My nigga had suspenders. He didn't. He wasn't bare like this. Yeah, they they made. He him. wasn't bare like this, bro. He wasn't bare like that. He was bro. this. He was with suspenders, bro. He on, had the bro. he had the ranger hat come and suspenders. Come on, dog. Simply worn pants on, without dog. suspenders. Come Here's on, some man. Of what people remember, also known. That's how he looked. Known as residue evidence. In the, the bear Mandela wasn't bare. Fruit Loops <sighs> flip flop. You may be thinking, I already know this Mandela effect. Why is he bringing it up again? What is it? Well, trust me, there's a new update to this. How do you remember Fruit Loops being spilled? Is it fruit spilled with two O's? Def. Def. Maybe. Like, it don't look wrong, but it don't look right either. But I also remember only the bottom one having the. Mm. The loops with the mm. that don't look right. It kind of don't, but I don't. I also I don't. don't remember seeing the regular fruit. Also, yeah, me neither. Also, we being real, like Fruit Loops change their branding all the time. It, that is true. Or fruit spelled correctly. No fun. No fruit. way. Hell no. Nah. It's not it. I ain't show see ain't seen that, see that before. That. Hell no. Nah. I've never seen that. I can't be 100% I ain't never seen I ain't this ne- I, ain't I never, never Never in my hell life no. Never in my life hell Never no. in my life saw that <laughs> No Never way. in my life No way Fruit Loops is spilled with two O's uh, Spilled incorrectly for creativity's sake Though this has tripping tons of people up As they remember already going through this Mandela effect once Some remember that in the old Mandela effect Fruit Loops was spelled correctly With the U and the I 
and that the Mandela nah, effect buddy. was that people misremembered it being yeah, spelled yeah, yeah. with double O's. Yeah, yeah, like yeah, this, tripping. of course. Yeah, this Reddit user's reaction to the change states, wait, WTF. I remember being shocked that it wasn't spelled fruit with double O's, but it is now actually spelled that way. It's a Mandela effect <laughs> of a Mandela Damn, effect. buddy, you going Something through it. Something that I'd never believe would happen. They going and it's through crazy it. to think about. A Mandela it's got effect some squared. thinking that we're living in a broken timeline. Gotta be, bro. Some I agree. Like, imagine, just imagine bro, the is, possibility is of that, the timeline being broken. Is that collider? Collider? Yeah, the collider? What, what are you talking about? The particle collider? Who are we talking about? Here? You ain't never heard the story of the... No. Mo- okay, so... No, 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 no. You don't want to no, hear? No, 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 no. It's, I'm good. It, it's scary. I I'm good. I'm, I'm sorry. Okay. Nope. I am okay. Full screaming. Full screaming. Okay. Nope. Full screaming. I am okay. So uh, I am a hundred percent okay. Essentially, I think it was. What year was it? 2013. 2012, 2013. Or was it the 2012? The world gonna end whole thing. Well, the timeline no. switched. So this is what happened. What 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 year was it? Somebody knows the year. It was the particle. It's a particle accelerator or a particle collider. Regardless, what happened? It was twelve thirteen. Essentially, that they many scientists were like, "Yo, you cut this on, you we mess up a little bit. Everything can go wrong, right? All right, because it's essentially several nuclear bombs going off at one time in a controlled environment. They're shooting particles at crazy speed, right? In a vacuum sealed space. So imagine." If a dust particle is in there, boom! Like nigga, it's but done. In a lab, it's a, yeah, it's in a machine. It's a giant machine, right? Oh my god! Essentially, there's there's several reports that when they cut on a particle uh, accelerator or the collider, something happened. They don't know what happened, but did you say slavery could have never happened until then? They, anyway, when they cut it on, <laughs> slavery was there. That, the uh, har- hydron the particle. Hydron particles. Yes, when they cut it on, many scientists say that something happened. And there's a scientist who works there that part of he he says he remembers it exploding. Oh my god! But he also but there's no proof oh, of it exploding. Simba's calling. Simba's calling. Or was it? It was CERN. It was CERN. Hey, Hello. Huh? We can. What you mean? What, what are you asking? It, it, I said, are we playing it? Because it's on your thumbnail. I'm trying to. It's not on our thumbnail. It was on the one from yesterday. Oh, that's the thumbnail. It says it's on there. Let's get. Started. Oh shoot! My fault. Let, let's play the. Can we play tonight though? We can play tonight. If it well, works. Well, I, I guess I got a. I got like a few things to do first, so it's not gonna be till like later. Okay, that's fine. My fault, y'all. Yeah, that was, I ain't changed the yeah, thummy. I'd be scared. My fault, my fault, my fault. Where are they, where are they at? <laughs> but y'all know what I'm talking about, right? The the basically, um, the particle accelerator All right, Genghis, Genghis. exploded. All right, it exploded in one of the sciences. One of the sciences says he remembers it, it it exploding, but there's no proof of it exploding. Why y'all ain't say nothing, chat? Why y'all ain't say nothing about a thumbnail chat? And it's yeah, the that's, it's that's, the it's when I say it's the scariest theory, and the thing is, up to that point, you can pinpoint. They say that's where they believe the split in the timeline started. Oh my god! That they lit, literally like scientists, oh my god. and like that's why it's always a big thing every time they talk about turning it on. Mm, like if you ever look, uh, the, the world skipped ten days in fifteen eighty two. What? What? There's another. There's another. Oh, my oh god. that's stop, another. Stop, look, 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 wait, wait, wait. So I think it was last year, a year before lives. That's why New Year's happened a minute late. It was time. Yeah, time. Y'all know what I'm talking about. We just go. We just go. We just go. Keep Y'all know what I'm talking about. Let's go. Keep going. We just it's go, keep flipping going. back and forth oh. in this current timeline. Brazil 9-11 Dragon Ball Z. What? This one's got huh? a funky title, but let me explain. A lot of people argue that Mandela Fix mainly changed things within the United States and United States culture, but here's one from a different country. This Mandela Fix pertains to people in Brazil on the day of September 11th, 2001. Check out this post of someone from Brazil explaining it. It has a total of 5,000 upvotes. 
Okay. First of all, in Brazil, you typically don't go to school, middle school or high school, doesn't matter, for the entire day. You are in school either in the morning, okay. usually 7.30 a.m. to noon, or in the afternoon, usually Damn, what a great schedule. to 5.30 p.m. Nice. Every single person schedule. who was a kid in Brazil and was not in school in the mornings on the day of September 11th, tons of people remember watching Dragon Ball Z and having it to, to be interrupted for the breaking news of the attacks. And right. I mean everyone. It comes up every single time someone asks, what were you doing when September 11th happened? Okay. Except Dragon Ball Z wasn't even on at the time. Someone checked the airing times and compared them to the time when the attacks occurred, and it was definitely not on. Maybe it was Still, just the same a whole day. generation of kids is 100% sure that they were watching Dragon Ball Z when Damn. the news broke out. Edit. Everyone's saying this isn't real and they edited the timetables after the fact. The you sound like conspiracy theorists. Look up Occam's Razor. This has been thoroughly discussed by Brazilians on the internet. It's not something new. Like someone else said in this thread, the TV show that played Dragon Ball Z wasn't even aired on that day. Mm. Scary movie 2. Take my... There, I, I think... What are you trying to say? I, I can't. I mean, I ain't Brazilian, so uh, like, <laughs> what, what do you want me to do with what that? You, you trying to, okay, like, what you want me? To- I, I didn't know what you were trying hand. to say. In yeah. Scary Movie Two, there's a bit in which Chris. Elliott- oh yeah, it's strong hand. I'm never going to believe this. You never. It, 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 w- it was take my strong hand. I remember running around school after seeing this movie. Take my strong hand. Okay, what did he let's, let's see. Let's see. Let's that see. has a small mutilated hand right? that grosses everybody out due to the it fact that he s- uses it while preparing dinner for his guests. Now, there's a very specific scene in which someone rem- oh, I remember him. Ah! The window and struggles to get back inside. This ah! is where the Mandela effect kicks in. Some vividly remember Hansen, the character with a deformed hand, stating, "Here, take my strong hand," when offering to help him. Although he never says hand? this, he simply states, "Here, take my hand." Although some recall reenacting this scene multiple times with the punchline being Whoa. that the strong hand is obviously the non-mutilated Whoa. one, but instead he uses the mutilated Whoa. one, which people are uncomfortable with. There are even memes Whoa. depicting him stating strong hand. That hands. was crazy. See? Let me know if you guys recall it always being. It was strong way. hand. It was strong hand. I this remember. This video is sponsored by G Fuel. So G Fuel. I would. I would imagine it being a uh, strong hand as it a would. joke. I feel like that's their type of comedy. To be to say strong hand, it definitely was strong hand when you think about it because yeah. there was no. I remember, this is how it was. Right, I remember everybody was running around school saying, "Take my strong hand, take my strong hand." Right, I didn't know what they were talking about. That day, I went home and watched the movie. Mm-hmm. I was, I was. It was Saturday, Monday. They were saying it. Tuesday, I came back and I was saying it. Mm-hmm. Mm, take my hand, and take Nightmare my on hand. Elm Street Mandela Effect regarding movie scenes coming up soon in the vid, so stay tuned for that as well. The hack and slash citrus fruit grape contain oh, cantaloupe and it's and so it's not the that Bible. I remember there being serpents, snakes, and other beasts found in the Bible vaguely, but not specifically dragons. A dragon? That's where this dragons Mandela Effect. I ain't never heard play. that one. A large group of people do not remember there one. being any mentions of dragons in it, the Christian yeah. Bible, although dragons never. are mentioned at least 35 times in the King James Version. 35? The version of the English Bible. Some people what? argued this, saying that 35? they only appeared in the Revelation chapter, the final book what? of the New 35? Testament, the only apocalyptic book in the Bible that is considered what? canon. I have never, 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 never. I, when I tell you, I went through Catholic basically school like Never. our sunday school whatever you want to call it to do our confirmation there was a grade every grade we went through in regular school we went through in in church i went through every grade learned about the bible every year i never heard of a goddamn dragon. dragon a dragon a dragon a dragon <laughs> what Though this is entirely wrong as the word dragon appears 21 times in the old testament alone this has left some people confused and searching for an explanation. Some have concluded that these dragons were in fact describing dinosaurs. Same thing goes for the creature Levi. First of all, that would make no sense. And let me explain so why. Me tell me. Okay. The paleo- pa- Paleolithic era, our current era, and the era in which dinosaurs roamed are separated by a meteor. <laughs> It is separated by a fucking meteor. Yeah, so basically it would be impossible for the people in the Bible to experience the dragon. I mean, experience dinosaurs. 
But I ain't never heard also, about no dragon. Also, let's let's do this one better. If we were around then, we wouldn't be around now. <laughs> if it was dragon. <laughs> Ah, is it? Yeah. Biathan, found in the book of Job, the a boom, massive boom, powerful rock is crazy. sea monster that some believe was a sea dinosaur, or factually known as mosasaurs. What do you guys think? Does anyone so remember mean this these whole time, People have been like, oh, when were dragons first thought up? It was fucking dinosaurs. It was, it was just dinosaurs. It was just... But the, cra- the craziest part, now, I will say this. I will say this. It, it was, you're... Big Bang. Wait, huh? What, that are, you nigga's talk- an idiot. what are you talking that about? That nigga's an idiot. Akira. A- ah, ah, Akira. You tripping. Akira, the Big Bang the Big started Bang it started all. started everything. But look, but look, so peep, so peep. The one thing I do believe, I believe that dragons and dinosaurs are exactly the same thing, right? Mm-hmm. The reason why I believe that, some dinosaur bones, first of all, there's no, we don't know if dinosaurs look like what they look like. Niggas they, are they, guessing. They most likely They're didn't. guessing. Right, they most likely didn't. But a lot but of it's possible because alligators look like dinosaurs. But that we probably that, where they got it from. Yeah, yeah, it's it's based off of small like assumptions, yeah. right? And then if you look at it, people, if you look at like genome and uh, scientific theory, they say that birds are more more closely related to dinosaurs than mm-hmm. alligators are. Right. Right. What up, Taz? So when looking at the science of evolution. There's so many parts that just don't fit what is our our current understanding of animals, right? So I say that I to still say, don't understand how they even understand what could have been around. <laughs> but look, so Pete, well, it's carbon yeah, dating, yeah. a whole bunch of different stuff like that, and then they look at what's been preserved. Uh, I'm not a nerd. Uh, <laughs> uh, Nerger. <laughs> anyway, anyway, so this is the thing. This is the thing. The reason why I believe dragons existed, a lot of dinosaur bones are hollow, right? Mm-hmm. Hollow bones over time are going to fucking disintegrate. So when you're finding fossils, the fossils you're finding are the ones that weren't as hollow and were still around mm-hmm. that that survived the decay. So there's parts also, of Also, the- there's been mentions of dragons in almost oh! every all cultures <laughs> And people couldn't even connect back then. Exactly. People couldn't even connect back before ships and all that. That niggas couldn't. Con- so how would everybody separately have dragons? Exactly. It's so, crazy. Now I ain't gonna lie. The, my my favorite theory about dragons, like my, it's the mwah, Trey Magnifique. They're aliens. They're aliens. It's the coolest theories. The dragons are aliens theory. So fucking cool. Okay, we'll, we'll talk about that later. Okay. Just being in the Bible, or were they added later? Michael Jackson's Smooth Criminal. Oh, this shit. One is what are we doing? Controversial. What are we doing? Most of you guys have what probably already heard the song Smooth Criminal you by King of Pop, by, Michael Jackson. You've been right? struck by Well, how do you guys remember criminal. the bridge of the dun, song dun, 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 going? Dun, dun, dun. Is it you've been hit by, you've, you've been, been struck, struck by, by a, a Smooth Criminal? Is that how you remember yeah. it? I was well, it actually it. states in the original recording, you've been hit by, you've been hit by a smooth criminal. The line simply repeats, nothing different. Although many... You've been hit by, you've been struck by a smooth criminal. Nah, it's struck. It's struck. It's definitely struck. You've been hit by, you've been struck by smooth criminal. Oh, God. Oh, God, it's struck. It's hit double. Nah. Okay. Oh God is struck. Okay. Let's see. Any others remember the word struck being used in the second line? Here are some covers of the song made by people that remember it this way. You've been hit by. You've been hit by a smooth. No. You've been struck by a smooth criminal. You've been hit by. You've been struck by a smooth criminal. You've been hit by. You've been struck by a smooth criminal. How is everybody getting How? wrong then? How what? How is everybody? everybody? Nigga, that was the flesh. You tell you telling Barry Allen he wrong. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. Why? Would, how would they? What? Because if you're doing that a don't cover, even sound if you're right. Doing a cover, wouldn't you look up the lyrics beforehand? Bro, that don't even sound right. Hit by twice don't even sound right. That don't all. even sound right. It. Thank you, you been Suzanne. Hit by, Thank you, you Suzanne. Been hit by. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. You've been hit by, you've been struck by a smooth criminal. You've been hit 
smooth. Where is Michael when you I need him? I ain't gonna lie. I, buddy, yeah, he, he was doing it, huh? He's dead. But I know, but but those white guys are the greatest white guys to have. <laughs> like just around. Like when traffic gonna be like 60, that's gonna be traffic. Okay. Like I'm telling and Luz. I believe it. <laughs> Luz gonna be walking around with a can of beer out with, Oh god damn it, Aaron. <laughs> <laughs> You've been struck Ain't that his daughter? A smooth criminal Who daughter? Though I'd like he to is. note that in some live performances Such as concerts and such He does appear to say struck by In the second verse But not in the first verse Which is a subtle and unexplainable change Explaining If he said it, he said it I don't give a damn yeah, He facts, said it facts, That's why we said Because he said it Facts Facts Maybe why some people remember it this way Though some dedicated it, MJ Michael. fans Still remember the original recording Containing the lyric Take a listen to the Argentinian concert version At the 320 minute mark More than halfway in yeah, If it's there If it's there As long as it got both if it's I'm a, cool yeah, I don't care about As long that. as it got both Converse logos. Holy this moly. one's sure to spark Holy some moly. comments. Holy as I see moly. a lot of people arguing start. about it online already. So you guys know the famous shoe brand Converse, right? Okay. And this their what signature truck. We about to piss some people. We about, probably about to get pissed off. So what we gonna do? So we gonna good. start up the Twitchy Twitch Chuck Taylor model. Let's go back. You Let's guys know it. the famous shoe brand Converse, right? And mm -hmm. their signature Chuck Taylor model. Right. Well, some people remember the logo facing the outside, like sure. many other shoe brands, in order to advertise the brand even more. Being on the ankle, the logo was always on the inside face of the shoe. That's a fucking lie. That's a fucking lie. That's a fucking lie, Mount Dew. You're a liar. Now I know it's you're for alive. sure been on one side. It's it's been on the ankle on the outside, on the outside. Why would it be on the inside? That doesn't even make sense. That, but I don't recall a shoe being blank on the outside. It's always been on the outside, and sometimes it was. I've both. only ever bought low tops. All right, let's see, let's see. Yeah, this has some people tripping out. But not all, as some distinctly remember it being a unique feature to the Converse Chuck Taylor model, due to it facing the inside of the shoe. Uh -uh. Spared it away scene. If you don't know, Spared it away is a 2001 girl has Japanese sides. anime okay. film written and directed by Hayao Miyazaki, the legend in the appreciate you. industry. Spared it away tells the story of a 10-year-old girl who, while moving to a new neighborhood, okay. she enters the world of Kami. Spared <laughs> Mandela effect my ass. This is gaslighting. <laughs> Facts. Facts. I feel you, bro. I know gaslighting I when I see you, you bro. You say this is gaslighting. <laughs> Girl who, while moving to a new neighborhood, she enters the world of kami, spirits of Japanese Didn't they remake folklore. this like an American? After her parents are turned or into pigs by a movie? witch, mm -hmm. the 10-year-old takes a job working in Yubaba's bathhouse, the witch's house, to find a way to take herself movie. and her parents and return to the human world. A truly majestic and beautiful movie, I might say. Now, this Mandela effect comes from people in Japan who remember a scene in the movie differently. They regard it as the phantom ending. Believed to be part of an extended cut, people scram to find the Get scene everywhere across Bell, the internet, but it sadly led to nothing, as the scene simply didn't exist. In order not to spoil it for you guys, I'm not going to explain the end, but I'll simply say uh, that it ends on the grandma? scene where a tunnel is depicted. Though most don't remember it this way. Uh -huh. They don't remember that it stops there, and they remember that it keeps on going for a few more scenes Damn, as depicted knows. in this Minecraft reenactment of the phantom ending so where did it go is everyone simply you. misremembering some say that it may have been shown you, only in the theatrical releases although this was proven to be wrong by the creator Hayao Miyazaki himself well, I don't remember Shaggy's it. Adam's I don't remember Apple it. here is something that may surprise you Shaggy he from Scooby-Doo the franchise has never appeared with an Adam's Apple in all of the canon series and media up to 2021 Dylan appreciate, appreciate you Dylan gifted. he only had it like when they swallow something and it <laughs> It's never an Adam's apple, though. And you may say something like, okay, maybe he doesn't have it all the time, but it definitely occurs when he gulps or yeah, states yeah, that's his not cash Adam's apple, though. zoink, right? Nope. It never appears even when he's swallowing or gulping what? Or his catchphrase. None of his... Oh. Oh. What? Oh. What? Bobby, take Yo, it off I love your videos and streams. 
Thank you, thank you. Yeah, Bobby, take it off slow mo. Take it off slow mo, Bobby. Why you put it in slow mo? Stop doing that. <laughs> Yeah, stop doing that, buddy. Uh, Trey, Trey, appreciate to get this up. Designs depict him with an Adam's apple. Though for some specific scenes from the show, what? he has shown swallowing oh, with a lump me? down his throat, which may be an explanation for some of these Mandela fix, although some yeah. argue that it is not the way that they recall his Adam's apple being. They recall a more pronounced and defined nah, feature. That's nah, realistic. I ain't never when seen that. It seems like people may be confusing. Yeah, I ain't never seen but that. But then again, his original character designs don't have a prominent Adam's apple as people remember. Remember. Here's a clip of what people remember him like. No hell no. Whoa. No. Who the hell is that? I ain't gonna lie. These new that, that was the worst. <laughs> that look. That's the second worst rendition of all of Scooby in the game. But like, why would he swallow? Would it not? I don't. Yeah. yeah nah. His neck is like the skin. What? Yeah nah. What? Yeah nah. I this remember. is gaslighting, bro. It gotta be. It gotta be, bro. <laughs> Dogs it's gotta be, poker. bro. Okay. Oh, can probably the painting. Recall the famous painting yes. of dogs playing mm -hmm. poker. Yes. Everywhere. Now, you guys recall Grandma house. them wearing green transparent visors in any of the variations of the painting? Yeah. Well, you'd be mistaken due to the fact that in most, if not all, popular variations, they are not wearing nope. anything on their heads at all. Nope. Let huh? alone a green transparent nope. visor nope. as many people recall nope. them wearing. Nope. There is in this one variation in nope. which a single dog nope. is wearing nope. a green hat. Nope. But it's nowhere nope. close to a transparent visor and they aren't even playing poker. Though this is the closest thing I remember the transparent visor Right And the reason I don't I, remember the transparent visor It was a I green transparent visor. visor I don't remember the visor Let me tell you why I remember it I remember like It was on the It was on the bulldog I remember seeing it on the bulldog specifically And I also remember seeing that green visor Like what the hell is that And looking it up um, Because I saw the picture later on in life And I had looked it up To see the fucking that people use those visors in actual poker, like the dealer where it used to wear hats and shit like that. Mm. Thing that and may have been confused with. Do you guys recall something similar, or is this just a huge mix-up? What else? SpongeBob you had shoelaces. No, he didn't. This Mandela uh, effect is in reference to SpongeBob's yeah, yeah, yeah. shoes. It was only and one episode. Not, they contain shoelaces. We, we, we well, been through this one. They don't. Though many we people been recall this SpongeBob sure. always depicted with white shoelaces with nope. the bunny rabbit tie method. This was never the case. Nope. His original character design depicted him with plain black shiny shoes. Though there is a piece of media where this might derive from. Mm -mm -mm -mm. It comes from the Loop de Loop song performed by band Ween for the series, teaching people how to tie their shoes. Finally depicting a Spongebob with shoelaces. I Hello, can see my why baby. They would Hello, my baby. Hello, my... Hello, my baby. Hello, my darling. Hello, my showtime girl. Okay, okay, okay. What up, Greg? This Welcome, first timer. To the Michigan J Frog tune in which he's dancing and singing his right time, line, yeah. Hello, my baby. Hello, my what? Darling. What's does he say after what does that? He say? What is does it he say? darling? If you thought it was darling, uh -oh. you'd be mistaken. Uh -oh. It's actually honey? hello my baby, oh. hello my honey. Let me tell you why that's honey? a motherfucking lie. Honey? Let me tell you why that's honey, a motherfucking though. lie. Let me tell you why that's a motherfucking lie. This is not a honey. I'm 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 look here, you gaslighting fuck. Okay. Okay. You can't talk to me about Looney Tunes. I am a Tuniac. Okay, yeah, I'm a Toontown resident. I've been saying it for the whole I got the duration of this channel. I have. He be remembering cartoons like it ain't no more. And nobody can talk to me about Looney Tunes. I remember all of them. I remember <laughs> all of them. Getting aggressive. I remember all of them. <laughs> like I remember, I remember small details that people don't remember. How the fact that Chuck Jones also worked on Tom and Jerry and Looney Tunes at several parts of his fucking life. Okay. Okay. It was hello my baby, hello my darling, hello my ragtime gal. I know. Man, he about to play it though. He about to play it though. It's and I don't care what it <laughs> says. And look, let me let me and I'm about to show you. I'm about to show you why you cooked. Watch why you this. Cook, why they cook? Why they cook? Why they cook? Why they cook? Warner Brothers huh? is notorious for altering and re-releasing. Animations to the public mm -hmm. as if it's the original, but it's not. And I'm gonna do you one better. That's why they had the problem when people started um, bringing up the old cartoons, mm -hmm. the old racist cartoons. They did their best to try to like bury it, and they re released 
edited versions like that's what it's always been nah. and it wasn't nah. and they could they literally could not fight it that's why if you go to hbo uh max or whatever right now and watch one of the older shows at the beginning it says this is from a time uh it's like it, it has a disclaimer about it at the they beginning had to keep the original yeah yeah which tons of it's people not honey. Call differently I can't find a single version of the song online where the word darling is used instead Damn. of honey. If you guys have any Damn. versions where this is the case, leave a comment. As one Reddit user put it, I sing this all the time to my pets. Hello, my babies. Hello, my darlings. Hello, my good time dogs. So, yeah, darling for me, I recall it from Play some joint, old Looney Tune cartoon. I can also recall a frog dancing and doing high kicks while singing it. He, he also had a dancing. talk. Tell me that he nigga was wasn't high kicking. He, tell me. Yeah, tell, he was I dare dancing. you. I double dog dare dancing. you to tell me. He, and also, also, I'll do you another one. I'll do you another one. The frog bit from from Family Guy right. when Peter's trying to put the frog in the box that originated in Looney Tunes when uh, he was hitting the frog with the box. You cannot. It's many things you can't talk to me about. <laughs> Cartoons being one of them. Okay. Facts. I feel it. I feel it. I feel it. But I could also see Foghorn Leghorn singing it as well. The Last You're not Supper, go, oh, he didn't the play last Supper oh. is a mural painting by Leonardo da Vinci. Okay. This painting represents the scene of the Last Supper of Jesus with his 12 apostles. As it's said in the Gospel of... I don't care if it's honey. Look here, you're from a different universe, okay? <laughs> Let me break this down to you. Did you watch the Yo-Yo 808 feed? Yeah, fuck Yo-Yo. <laughs> what he do? That nigga said he put the bean bag on me. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, he's a fucking liar. <laughs> You're not anybody who oh says, my God. "Bro, I'm I am forever running with." Oh my God! The, the world has collided into another universe. John, specifically, the moment after Jesus announces that one of his apostles will betray him. This Mandela effect touches on a missing object in the painting, that being a gold cup. Many people remember gold there cup. being Where's a gold the chest? cup the, the, yeah. right besides Jesus sitting yeah. on the table. The Although looking at the painting now. There is no gold chalice anywhere on the Where's table. The so where is the holy grail? It's oh, on the wall. Yeah, out of everywhere, puzzling tons of people due to it being in a bizarre place. We got time travelers. We got time travelers. Somebody them. There's somebody. a fucking chalice. I've been staring at this paint. Remember when I said I went to the fucking Catholic Sunday school from first grade all the way to 12th? Look, let me tell you what happened. I'm going to tell y'all what happened. Fuck a million. We use a chalice. In the painting, there's a chalice. Let me tell y'all what happened. During service, somebody, there's a chalice. Somebody went back in time and moved the pencil and fucked us all up. On the wall? On the wall? We got to Bro, we what literally... What sense does we that make? We literally have to have time. Why would the chalice be on the wall? You want to know the craziest part? You want to know the craziest part? I have this, this vivid memory of a movie that doesn't exist. And what is it? It's about niggas going back in time. And niggas getting trapped and they alter the future. I have a and niggas say the movie does not exist. Niggas, Nick, we gotta have time travelers at this point. Is this new to you guys or do you guys on the always wall? Remember that? I do remember being in front of them. That bit was right up being on the wall. It was no plastic cups. Question How many wine glasses are there on the table? One. The Holy Grail? Open your eyes. No single cup. No chalice. Well, that's a bit strange, isn't it? Nope. Considering both nope. the Bible and standard... Nope. Nope. No. You're not going to gaslight me. No. You're not going to gaslight no. me. The gaslight is crazy. It's insane. Gaslight right. worse than Aaron. Everyone should know this little trucker by now. What? I didn't enjoy watching him as a kid, but I've nah, really loved the him. first two movies of the franchise. They're classics. The new one seems more like a cash grab than anything, though. Either way, this one. What the hell bro, is that? That can't be real. <laughs> no shot, bro. First no of all, no shot. They tried first, that. First of all, let me explain something. First that, of all, look at the family. Look, I was about look to say, look at that that Milton pot. <laughs> what is the, what is what? The little effect covers his famous catchphrase in the film. You probably remember Chucky saying. Hi, I'm Chucky, and I'm your friend till the end. Oh, no, right? I don't remember that. Well, in the movie, he actually states, Hi, I'm Chucky, and I'm your friend till the end. 
Yeah. None of the movies in the franchise ever depict him saying till the end, including the remakes and sequels. Mm-hmm. Though lots of people remember I don't know the about catchphrase, that one. including the word that Appreciate till, you, Big Bean. Making the statement sound less menacing because it's a children's toy. There's even a fan-made film titled Chucky Friends Till the End. Even the super fans got it wrong, as well as other mm-hmm. artwork that depicts mm-hmm. the line tons of people remember. Do you guys mm-hmm. recall it always being this way? I'm Andy! Hi, I'm Chucky. And I'm your friend to the end. I hate Adios. that little fucker. <laughs> Missing emoji. It, I think they just think it sounds like till the end. Yeah. I, it I, just sounds like I'm not a real end. horror yeah. fan, so I ain't. This is in reference to emojis that people believe have now gone missing. Which ones? Or have Which ones? They remove them. They always they, remove yeah, them. They, yeah, they, they yeah, literally yeah, yeah. existed. Like, for example, the robbery emoji. That existed. It was never it, there. No, it was. No, it was. Emoji as no, well. no, no, no. Now there's more. Some people recall there being an orange traffic cone emoji that tons of iOS there, users there would there use. There fucking was. There fucking was. The robber existed. The robber sure. existed for sure. The traffic cone was also used. Let me tell you why the robber. Let me tell you how I know the robber existed. I used to send that bitch. Yeah. I remember looking for that mug. And I'm using it, you're not going. You're not going to lie to me. Well, there's Sometimes that. you like skip over them, and you got to go back. Oh shit, where I missed it? Da da da. Be to capture Come attention on, better on a post Come or on, warning bro. someone about something. This emoji would supposedly be used. Well, if you have iOS and try to access a traffic cone emoji, nah, you won't find any results. Nah, there's nah, also nah. the green peas emoji, which tons of people recall using. I used that motherfucker. No way it didn't exist. No way. No way. On iOS. But mm. it's not there, mm. as well as the moose emoji. Do you guys remember the any of these, or are people simply confusing hold softwares? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Traffic con should be here, traffic con. Right. No way. They getting us with emojis now. Emojis. They doing us this dirty. Emojis. It's the last thing I. Search it. No traffic cone. No, bro. They man, bro. They, that's go, they bro. robbing us. They robbing us. They bro. robbing us blind. Hold on. Let's see this. Let's see this. You want to see this one? All right, bro. Flintstones flip flop. I found this one on a Reddit. Okay, I would know this one. In the Mandela effect community, which means when something changes, quote unquote, in our reality, but then reverts back to I'll its correct that. form or the form the Mandela effect believers remembered. The comment reads, um, the spelling of the Flint stones changed to the Flint stones in 2017. Then a guy made a YouTube video about how ridiculous the spelling change was. Then about a week later, the spelling changed back to its original form. Okay. I tracked all of this in real time since I became obsessed with the Mandela effect in 2016 after learning about Billy Graham still being alive, a famous preacher that many thought had died earlier than 2018. The guy's YouTube video about the Flint stones is a timestamp of the flip. Let's take a look at the video. Wow. Let's check it out. Flintstone spelt the wrong way, got more hits from 2004 all the way to present. Even present, people have been spelling it wrong. Only people, the majority of the people that got it spelled right was look. Poland. Poland? <laughs> Notice in the video he says people are spelling it wrong about flint stones even though that it is the way that it's spelled now. This is an interesting find. One reply to I the never post really thought states, about this. he made a mistake, plain and simple. It did not change to flint stones in 2017. Had it, people in the Facebook group would have been all over it. It would have been flooded with posts. No, after post- that's, that's, that's an error in the matrix. They, they couldn't. That's one of those small, minute details. So it's the matrix now? Bro, it's Matrix time travel. It's a motherfucker <laughs> doing some crazy Tate, Tate shit. Been treating, teaching look, you. Look, look, Cobra Tate. You're bald. <laughs> <laughs> Why are you attacking him? Because I don't what? know. I, like, you know, I'm sorry. You, you, okay, he couldn't think nothing else. So but he look, attacked him. I, if he made a video about people saying it incorrectly, right? No, he made a video about it changing, changing, right? Yes. And now it's back to it. Like, come on, bro. Come on. Mm. To claiming it changed Then post after post Saying how it changed back Neither happened But it is exactly things like this That caused the perception of a flip flop What do you guys think about this one? I don't know Michael Jackson's uh, chain. chain Here's another interesting one from the thread Regarding Michael Jackson on the Thriller album cover You know the one where he's laying on his side Well the post reads I saw Mike- this before I'm gonna be so real not, That nigga ain't never wear that hoodie 
that's that's the thing. That it hoodie, wasn't even a chain. It was the fact that it's a hoodie. That nigga wasn't wearing a hoodie. A hoodie. He wasn't wearing a hoodie. This nigga wearing a hoodie and a suit. He wasn't wearing a hoodie. Why does that even make sense? He was wearing a black button up. Why does the hoodie even there? Why would appreciate you, Traffy? Appreciate it, man. Traffy. Michael Jackson's man. chain or lack of on the thriller cover. At one point he had an unobtrusive but noticeable gold chain around his neck on the nah, cover. I don't remember a then chain. one day it disappeared. People even posted about it. I can't yeah, remember, I remember if it was chain. here or elsewhere, but I remember reading but posts about that it. That being a hoodie. I don't remember crazy. that hoodie. And I don't remember that tiger in his hand either. I Ta- whoa. whoa. I, don't, I don't know when that whoa. tiger got there. Whoa, whoa, whoa. But it, I didn't really think whoa. much of it until I happened whoa. to see the cover. I ain't never, I ain't never seen that tiger. <laughs> <laughs> but that's hold on, bro. They just, bro. We just had a switch we real had, time. We just, bro, we just looked at the image and it wasn't a tiger. Bro, we just what? had a switch what? real time, bro. What? Hey, hold up, bro. Where that fucking tiger come from? <laughs> oh, hold the fuck up, bro. Hold the fuck where that tiger came from, nigga. Where the fuck that fuck? Hey, hold the fuck up. Hold the fuck up. Hold the fuck Where did that tiger come from? Bro, where did that tiger come from? Oh, where the goddamn bro, is? Bro, where did that tiger come from? Shit. <laughs> Chat, wait, wait a, wait a minute, wait a minute. Wait, 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 wait. Okay, okay, I'm the boy. Well, the post reads noticeable gold. I can't remember if it was here or elsewhere, but I remember reading posts about it. I did. Okay, I knew I wasn't tweaking. Oh, you, you, you went too far for it. Oh. Didn't really think much of it oh, until God. I happened to see the cover again in a record shop whilst sifting through vinyls. And now he did have a chain. This was months, perhaps a couple of years later, after first realizing something had changed. At that point, I actually thought he did have so a chain. So the cover is just crap. I must have been I'm thinking assuming. he didn't have a chain. Bro, something ain't making sense. Bro. Wait, 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 what? Wait what? Wait 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 and I couldn't find any post about it either. This is one of the most confusing things that's ever happened to me where I can't offer a definite explanation. This nigga just gaslit bro, us. Gaslit this nigga, everything, This bro. nigga just gaslit us, bro. bro. That nigga bro. put a tiger. Chat. Why you put the image of the tiger? Chat, 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 chat. <laughs> chat. Bro, On that note. But no, on that no. Note, bro. And the thing that makes it worse, you got niggas in here, oh, that tiger been there. It's always nah, been yeah, there. Nah. Nah, look, we done with this one. We done with it. We gonna we gonna do a part two. Oh my god. Oh my god.